Curse me, Hiltz. Me money bin alarm. Quick, Duckworth, get the limo. I shall, uh, <clears throat> get out in gear, sir. Hurry, Duckworth, hurry! The pedal is to the metal, Mr. McDuck. Oh, not the Beagle Boys again. If they think they can stand between Scrooge McDuck and his three cubic acres of cash, they've got another thing coming. Boy. Yeah, but you better watch out. The Beagle Boys mess with your security system. Ooh, yeah, we take over the whole place. Yeah, <laughs> me money. Hey, don't forget about me, Uncle Scrooge. Eh? Oh, 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 don't worry, lad. I'll save you. Oh, 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 now that's what I call a stomachache. You were hit on the head, you moronic marauder. Thanks, Uncle Scrooge. You're welcome, lad. But Huey, what are you doing here? Well, we saw the Beagle Boys going into the money bin. We? Sure. Louie and Dewey are here, too. You better hurry, Uncle Scrooge. They might be in trouble. Away from him, you gluttonous goon! Sorry, Scroogey, not a chance. <laughs> you saved me, Uncle Scrooge. I did. Are you hurt, lad? Now nah, I'm fine, but I saw Louie heading up the stairs with about a thousand Beagle Boys right behind him. Stay here. I'll handle this. Thank you. 
always an adventure. Hold on, lad. I'll have you free in a jiffy. Not so fast, Big Duck. We're running things around here now. Curse me, too. One false move and I'm a roast duck. Leave me, a Scrooge. It's not worth it. Nonsense, my boy. You'll never beat us, Scrooge. Hey. When I get the gold, I'm gonna buy Ma a new cow! Woohoo! We almost got them all! A fat lot of good that will do us if they make it to me vault! Step away from me, Fortune, you crook. Uh, 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 not this time, a duck. Oh, you ain't getting the drop on this big old boy. That thing ain't gonna hurt me that way. Your sail is securely suspended, son. There you are, sir. That's smart. Ow. Everything is ready, sir. Me money. Oh, my aching head. There you are, sir. Curse you, my. This ain't the last you'll see of me! Eh, good riddance to bad beagles, I say. Now why in the world was he interested in this old painting? Surely there are more valuable... Well, pluck me pin feathers! It looks like some kind of secret code. Boys! Boys! What did you find, Uncle Scrooge? Yeah, what is it? I'm not sure, but I know how to find it out. I'll feed it into my supercomputer and use Gyro's new crypto analysis program. Then we'll know what the Beagle Boys were after. <laughs> Stand back, lads. Brigadoon! What is it, Uncle Scrooge? It's a treasure map, lads. And no ordinary treasure by the look of things. Only Uncle Scrooge would call any kind of treasure ordinary. Look! One of the treasures is in the middle of the Amazon. And there's another one in Transylvania. And one buried ten miles underground. Hey, wait a minute. Something screwy. This last treasure can't be right. Yeah, there's no mountain on Earth that's that high. Well, according to the Junior Woodchuck's guidebook, to get there we'd have to take about 537 million steps straight up till we reach the moon. You mean the moon moon? It looks that way, lads. <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? That treasure's not going to discover itself. 